Welcome to another online Personals Watch C level interview. Today I'm joined by Shema Katz, who is the CMO of SafeChart. Welcome to the interview. Thank you, Mark. So, Shema, tell us more about SafeChart. What do you do and what's the founding story of SafeChart? So, SafeChart is a payment provider established in 2000, provides today payment services to thousands of online and mobile merchants. Among them are the biggest in the dating industry. We provide them the connectivity to the acquiring bank, risk management services, and our main objective is to provide them the best payment conversion with minimized risk of fraud. So who do you work with in the internet dating industry at the state? So I'm, I'm looking at the, at the list of uh, online personal watch top uh, ranked customers and I can say that uh, we serve half a dozen of these uh, customers today. Why are they using safe charge? So they are using uh, safe charge because uh, of the experience that we have specifically in the industry and the technologies that have been customized specifically to serve this segment of uh, customers. So at the end of the day what we generate to them is the best payment conversion because we know the statistics, we know the techniques behind how to reroute the transaction to the proper acquiring bank. We know how to manage the fraud and the risk so that they get minimal false positive on the, on the fraud side and uh, basically at the end of the day, they get the best payment conversion and their minimized risk of fraud. We have a, a large negative database that has been built throughout the years, specifically to this industry. And uh, due to that uh, negative database, we know exactly who are the fraudsters and we know to block them ahead of time. Oh, no, that's interesting. So you've got a blacklist. We got a blacklist and the blacklist has been sp built throughout the years, 13 years that we are serving the industry, specifically to fraud patterns that uh, match the dating websites. iDating is one of your industries. What other industries do you work with? Yes, we uh, work mainly with sports betting, gaming, uh, online financial services, online games, retail, and the um, many other digital services. What would you say are some of the latest trends in the payment processing industry that are pertinent, that are uh, important for the internet dating industry executive to, to know about? So I guess uh, mobile payment is definitely one of the hottest trends in the industry for subscription to dating sites and uh, mobile payments get the uh, constantly growing share as more users use their mobile devices when they subscribe to the dating service. And we uh, also accommodate our payment services to support the mobile payments. So our uh, mobile payment page is uh, HTML5 compliant and uh, device agnostic so that the users get a native payment experience. In addition to that, uh, I would say that the increased uh, usage of alternative payment options, and we refer to alternative payment options to all the other payment options that are not, uh, different, not related to card payment. Uh, so these are definitely recently become a key factor to penetrate new and emerging markets. So the dating merchants are increasing the payment options that are available on their checkout page in order to increase the payment conversion in each uh, region. Of course, that's a great way of increasing revenue, just offering more options for payment. What has been hot, though, in the iDating industry specifically? What, what has done well um, in the way of alternative payment systems? What would you say is it would be the uh, top two additional, I guess it varies by geographic, but for say... Uh, so, uh, these are definitely various by geographic and I would uh, definitely say that mobile payments, so premium SMS and direct carrier billing are important factor. Also the uh, cash-based 
payment is a really growing um, and uh, important payment option in uh, some of the region. Some other just use uh, local bank transfers and uh, local e-wallets as uh, the most common way for uh, payments to the subscription for the dating website. And in terms of regulations, are there any new regulations that the industry should be aware of? Well, obviously, uh, regulation is developing, but I would, if I have to pick one, then I think that the enforcement of PCI, com PCI compliance by the card schemes has the m major uh, implication and implies that the merchants have to go through the process to become compliant with the PCI requirements. And what uh, we actually see is that more and more merchants prefer to use an external card vault to safely and securely store their customers' uh, sensitive payment information. This is actually the most effective uh, solution to still allow for the one-click payment for, of repeat customers while completely offloading the burden of PCI compliance to a third party like SafeCharge. Shema Katz, you're the CMO of SafeCharge. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you, Mark.